hello guys it's another day welcome back to my channel so today i have another tutorial so before we start if you're new to my channel please subscribe and hit the bell for you to be updated for my upcoming videos and if you like this video please give me a thumbs up leave a comment and share it to your friends this shoes is fit for four months to six months or four inch in size so in this project i use endful yarn scissor yarn needle stitch marker beads and of course tape measure to measure our shoes so let's start so ngayon gagawa tayo ng ating foundation chain 21 chain 3 4 5 6 7 and 21 and then we're going to double crochet into the fourth chain 1 2 3 4 double crochet at isa pang double crochet at the same stitch and 16 double crochet from here to the second to the last stitch. So, oh, 1, 2, 3. Continue working double crochet up to here. Second to the last. And dito sa ating last stitch, work 5 double crochet. So, 1, 2, Three, four, and five. Sixteen double crochet at this side. And to the last stitch, work two double crochet. One and two. Ngayon, mag slip stitch tayo sa third chain. So one, two, three. This is our third, third chain and slip stitch. Then chain one. Chain one is considered as a single crochet for this round. So we're going to put a stitch marker. Now we're in round two. For the next two stitches, work two single crochet in each stitch so we're going to increase so single crochet one single crochet and then two single crochet tapos isa pang increase so one and two then seven single crochet nang hindi increase one two three oops four five Six and seven. Two half double crochet. One and two. Seven double crochet. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Five double crochet increase. So, increase. So, one double crochet, two double crochet, sorry, two double crochet, and two the same stitch. So, I made one increase, so we need more four double increase. Now, we're going to work seven double crochet. One, two, three. Four, five, six, and seven. Then two half double crochet. So we're going to work exactly the same from this side. So half two half double crochet, and then seven single crochet. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Two single crochet increase for the next two stitches. One increase and then two increase. And for this stitch, which is our slip stitch in our previous round, we're going to put a single crochet, just a single crochet, one single crochet. Okay. And then remove our stitch marker and slip stitch. Oopsie, wait. Slip stitch. 
round three chain two and this is our first half double crochet in this round three so magi increase na naman po tayo gamit ang stitch na half double crochet for the next four stitches so one half double crochet two half double crochet two half double crochet and two the same stitch for the next four stitches so magawa na tayo ng isang increase at ito pangalawang increase ko na so kailangan pa natin ng dalawang increase so one increase and then two increase eight half double crochet one two three four five six seven oops seven and eight eight double crochet one two three four five six seven and eight then double crochet increase so one two two double crochet increase for the next nine stitches because i made one increase for the first stitch here so continue making your your um increasing the total of 10 increase of double crochet so i complete my 10 double crochet increase 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 now we're going ex we're working exactly the same from this side to this side so work 8 double crochet so 1 2 3 oops 4 5 6 7 and 8 8 half double crochet 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 4 half double crochet increase so 1 2 1 increase yan tapos 2 increase 3 increase and 4 increase so for the last stitch work 1 half double crochet and then slip stitch which our stitch marker attached now we are now we are done in our round three and then round four chain one this is our first single crochet put our stitch marker and then for this round work single crochet around so you should have um 70 stitches Um, tapos na ako sa ating round 4 so <clears throat> slip stitch tayo dito sa ating first chain round 6 is chain 1 chain 1 for this uh, shoes is always considered a single crochet so now we're working single crochet around again for this round but only work in back loops only so this is our front loop and this is our back loop so dito ka magtatrabaho ng single crochet sa ating back loop okay around i'm done with my round five and remove our stitch marker and slip stitch into the into that stitch and then chain one for round six and working again single crochet around for our round six and for our round seven 
a single crochet on each stitches but work it into the both loops okay this is my round six and I'm going to meet you when I'm done with my round seven now I'm done with my seven rounds and now I'm in round eight so I got I made already a chain one and put a stitch marker and then now work 20 single crochet so one two in 20 and then 14 double crochet close together so we're going to decrease so and close together now yarn over drop the yarn yarn over and then another one and then close so this is our two double crochet decrease continue working decreasing of double crochet until you complete the 14 14 double crochet decrease One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, then eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and then single crochet from here up to the last stitch, total of twenty one single crochet. Chain one, I mean chain one, single, uh, I slip stitch, and then chain one. So now we're in round nine single crochet all around the total of 56 stitches chain one and 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 round 10 19 single crochet so one two three eight double crochet decrease so Then in the next stitch, three loops and close together. So one decrease, two decrease, three, four. And then from here to here work single crochet 20 single crochet to finish our round 10 going to slip stitch into the first chain and then chain one so round 11 work single crochet Ay. round 11 work single crochet from here up to the last stitch single crochet And our round 11 slip stitch again and then chain one and they have a long tail cut the yarn so this is now how it looks like eto yung kanyang kaliwang um, part ng shoes so yung ginawa ko dito muna ako nag-start to work this um, lock ko no <laughs> count from the first stitch here from here to 13th chain 13th stitches I mean attach your yarn at dito ka magsisimula mag chain ka ng 23 dito ka magsisimula ng iyong pag attach ng yarn pero ito kasi ito yung kanyang kanan so kanyan dito ako magsisimula no so, ito yung kaliwa, ito yung kanan. So, dito ako magsisimula. So, mag-account mag, mag ako ng 13 stitches from here to here. Okay, so. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13. 
Tapos, magdadagdag ako ulit ng dalawa. 13, 14, 15, and then 16. In the 16th chain, dito ko i-coconnect ang aking yarn. So, Pawa muna tayo ng slip knot. And then, So, 1, 2, 3, 1, 22, 23. 23 chain and double crochet and 2, the 7th chain. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Dito mo itutusok ang yung hook at double crochet. Chain 2. And skip mo dito sa chain 2. Skip mo chain 2. And the third chain, double crochet ulit. Ay, sorry. And chain 2 ulit. Skip 2. Tapos in the third chain, double crochet. And then work double crochet into the last stitch uh, chain here. Uh, tapos ko na yung aking double crochet. Tapos... Count ka lang ng 2, chain, 1, 2, tapos pagka 3rd chain, no, sorry, 1, 2, at pagka 3rd chain, dito mo, ikakabit, mag slip stitch ka. And then, slip stitch, slip stitch, so continue working, slip stitch, hanggang dito, paikot, tapos dito, paakyat, hanggang dito, hanggang dito. Dito ang last na slip stitch. Okay. Tapos ko na ang aking slip stitch. And leave a long tail. Okay. Itong mga excess yarn, itago na lang natin to using our yarn needle. Okay. To secure the diamond on my ends. Like that, like that. Like that, like that. Ito na yung gagawin natin sa kabila. So, ganito mo iyahawakan yung, ano, yung shoes mo. At insert your hook dito sa loops. Okay? Dito sa loops. Ito na yung mo. Ayan. Diyan tayo magtatrabaho ng ating single crochet backwards. Ayan. Chain 1, and then work single crochet backwards. Oopsie. Like that. Ganyan po. Huh? Continue working until you reach the last stitch. So I'm in my last stitch and isa pang stitch. Tapos chain one and leave a long tail. Cut the yarn to the end. So, pasensya na sa manok kasi sobrang ingay talaga nila. Hindi talaga mawawala yung manok na yun sa mga tutorials ko. Lagi na nakikisabay. Parang gusto din mag-vlog. <laughs> Itago natin para hindi makita at hindi siya madaling matanggal. No? Tapos ito, ikakabit natin siya dito sa kabira. Itong beads na to. Parang ito. O, meron naman kayong butones. Pwede naman siya. Pero ito lang kasi yung may available ako. So, ito naman kagawin natin yung kanyang bow. And chain 36. 36 chains and slip stitch into the very first chain. Okay, and then Chain 1 and work single crochet on each stitches around. Okay. 
And then slip stitch into the very first single crochet we made. Then for row uh, round two, chain one, and then single crochet on each stitches around. And then continue adding rows until you reach row, uh, I mean row seven. Okay, with 36 single crochet. Now I'm in row 7 and then slip stitch and chain 1 and leave a long tail and cut the yarn. Okay, and then find the center of our bow and then wrap the yarn into the middle. Okay, like that, and then secure, tie it at the back, secure your own roof, and then And attach it into the middle of our baby shoes. It's your choice if you're gonna if you're gonna glue it. Mine, tinahi ko po siya. <laughs> tinahi ko siya para mas secure kahit na laban hindi siya matatanggal. So tinatahi ko siya dito, dito ganyan. Ganyan. Okay. Yeah, so this is the finished product of our tutorial for today. And thank you for watching. So guys, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And please comment, like, and share. So thank you for watching. Bye.